Hello everyone, and welcome to my second Grand Prix mode video. So, on this video then, I'm going to go for a classic car. So, that, that was my bad. Still not used to these menus yet. F1 Classic course first, then Grand Prix mode. So, I said I've only got the 80s cars for now. I haven't figured out to get the 90s yet, even if I can with a re reviewer mode. A review copy, sorry. Should we go for the Williams? I think we'll go for the Williams. Mansell or Hill? Go for Mansell, I think. So, all this will be the same. I'll do five laps again. I'll keep it on legendary difficulty. I'll still keep it on clear. And I'm actually going to do Monza. For now, I'll get into the classic tracks soon. But for now, I just want to directly compare the modern cars to the classics on the same track. That's a pretty wicked shot. Look at that. Flames kicking out the exhaust. There we go then. So, there's that filter. You can see it already. Making it look a bit more classic, a bit older. We'll leave that filter on for now. There is an option to disable it if you don't like it, which is good. But we'll leave it on for now for short. So setup wise then, I mean I don't know. All the setup settings are exactly the same. So I'm gonna load that setup that I created last time. Because that worked quite well last time, didn't it? So we'll keep it at that. And that's the only menu you get in a classic car, you don't see it in the car or anything. So, that's pretty much it. And I think we have to go on that to race, do we? Go, oh, it's on that one. Go to race. There we go. So, slightly different menu. I'm sure they probably will implement a similar menu to the modern cars in the next game. But for this game for now, we just have that. And there we go then. So, look at that. A classic car grid. Michael Schumacher in P1. There I am. No, that's not me. Sorry, didn't it? I went Mantle. That's it. I'm in P4. My teammate is in P2. Look at that. Look at that. Awesome. Really quick throttle response. And all slightly different OSD. Let's see if I can get a half decent start, which I've not really done. I'm not really sure when to shift or anything like that. And I don't know where to brake either. No! Oh, sorry. Um, it feels so dumb turning. Wheel spin there. Can't really do much about that. So I've lost places. Oh no, I haven't actually. I'm still in fourth. And they've backed out of it. I'm going to try and go around the outside of this guy and then dive to the inside on Schumacher. And that's worked quite nicely. My teammate now is in P1. And the thing you notice most of these is they like to wheel spin a lot. And they're definitely not as grippy as the modern cars. go then so trying to catch Hill then my teammate it's a Williams 1-2 at the moment of course just six gears in these cars didn't have seven at the time so I'm a lot faster than Hill there so he seems to be fairly slow actually for some reason the classic drivers will see if they can keep up me Cars fairly quickly. Let me see if I can nail the braking. The braking points, to be honest, a lot of it feels very similar to the modern cars in terms of braking points. The corner speeds, things like that. Doesn't feel hugely different, which is good. Makes it more intuitive. I can go straight to second to avoid some wheel spin, but still got loads of wheel spin there. That's my worst bit now, is exiting that corner. Schumacher's behind me now, then. See if he can catch me. I'm trying to break late. Almost get a bit of rear lock in there. These cars are, yeah, the power curve's quite interesting on them. It's not like a. Oh, 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 tried to step out of me there. It's not like a modern car. And yeah, this is, this is the AI. Seems to be slower on this moment, maybe it's just me getting more used to the game. But yeah, I do seem to be slower on this mode. Oh, a bit wide. Oh, nearly went out wide there. But not too slow. I'm not monstering them, but a bit disappointing. I will double check after this race that I am on legendary, but pretty sure I am. Bit of ball spin there. Trying to push a bit harder now. 
And it is a 25-0, so not that much slower than the modern cars either. Which is a bit strange. I wouldn't expect it to be catastrophically slow, but... And look at that. Different OSD there. Let's have a look at the tyre then. Not too bad at the moment. Uh, of course, I can use the fuel mixes. Forgot about that. Look at that. All, a, uh, all classic, of course, this uh, interface. Breaking 38 now. So, of course, not worried about tyre for now, so I'm doing lots of wheel spin, but in a real race, this would be killing my tyres, this driving style. I've had lots of wheel spin. Oh, lots of oversteer there. You can't really see my wheel, but I was definitely counter steering that. So, let's try. The uh, views then. Try a bit of cockpit cam, shall we? Lots of uh, obviously there on the game. You see how much I'm really using the wheel now. Make it look easier than it perhaps is. I quite like this cockpit cam. This is quite nice. I can use this. Bit of a. Uh, you can see the revolver there in the middle. Shows that's a bit more useful having that if you haven't got the well, you've got shift lights, but you haven't got um, you know, it's hard to tell in terms of what your revs are doing. That's a better corner, it's all loads of wheel spin on the exit though. So we sound a bit close behind me there, that's because this is a viewer copy, the sound levels aren't quite right just yet. It's looking like an easy win, isn't it? But it's okay. They, they do feel pretty wicked, though. Even if I'm not too sure, but the lap times seem a bit too fast to me. I mean, that, that might have been how quick they actually were. I've got a bit grass my tyres there. That might have been how they actually were. I don't actually know. But the lap times just do seem a bit fast, but the handling feels about right, though. Handling feels pretty much how you'd expect. It's quite loose, especially in these high-speed stuff. Because I just haven't got the downforce of the modern cars I've got. It's quite tricky. There you go. Let lots of oversteer. You wouldn't get that in a modern car. It would just grip through that. Two seconds. I'm assuming I can see. I am faster, but that's only in the first lap or so, wasn't it? More oversteer there. I'm going to rich now. Of course, I've still got plenty of fuel. Not too much fuel. The tyres are a bit warm, but not too bad. This should be even faster down here now then. Let's see if we can break later. We can break later on that for sure. Yeah, the power car's really weird. It uh, just suddenly kicks in. So uh, even if you're careful, it's quite... It's not very intuitive, the power car on this, but that's good. Because it means it's uh, a bit different to the modern cars. Obviously, there on the exit. Shift down now, first corner. Taking lots of speed in there now. I actually think I prefer this cockpit cam, to be fair, on this particular car. Better corner, wasn't it? Oh, very wide, almost in the gravel, but not quite. That's a better corner for sure as I'm up. Should be a fast stop of the race. Should be well into the 24s. Let's you kind of don't have to shift as much as you do in a modern car. You can keep it. It's got a bit more torque because the power kicks in nicely. That's 24 3, so very good final lap. So there we go, then easy win. Absolutely trounced him in the end. So, I'm not sure that was an interesting one, wasn't it? They seemed slow in the first couple of laps, but after that they seemed to pick up. But look at that. My fast lap was almost a second quicker than Schumacher. And what I'll do before I go, I'll double check. That is on Legendary AI. And there we go then. So, absolutely thrashed them. Disappointed, it must be said. I thought they might be a bit more competitive. But the handling feels nice. So, online races, time trial, things like that should be quite fun. It's perhaps not with the AI, but before I say that, let's just double check. So, 
the AI. That was hard as Mansell, wasn't it? Probably matter though. So, Legend. Let's have a look. AI yeah, difficulty, yeah, it was on Legend. So, perhaps a little bit slower than I was expecting, but they do feel really wicked, the, uh, the classic cars. Um, so, that's good to see. And I will do a classic track next. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.